Hey guys, LYZ here, aka Tiny Nemes. How are you doing today? And I want to go over a serious topic really quick. Um, it was about, it's about bullying. So, let's get started. I was seeing through social media and all this stuff and TV. It was like, I don't know what was going on. So many people were posting about bullying or something. Excuse me. Excuse me. Again. So, I was like, it reminded me of those stuff. So, I wanted to give you tips, advice, or whatever you want to call it, or just hear me out. So, all of this reminded me, flashbacks, or whatever you want to call it, I was like, Psh, I went back in time, when I used to get bullied, first grade through eighth grade. Sometimes it will stop, sometimes it will be more than other times, but I'll always get people talking shit to me, people poking on me or hitting me, or whatever the fuck you want to call it, and complaining about what I wear and stuff, or how I dress, how I act, whatever. Bully. So, um, I did negative things. I did positive things. Let me tell you the negative things not to go or what to do with it. Some people would tell me ugly slut. No, fat, no. Did I get fat? I don't know. They didn't tell me that much fat, but they were calling me slut, hoe, tramp, all this stupid, and then bitch fucking, I don't know, and then they would talk shit to me, they would also like, choke me, hit me, try to mess with my stuff, and everything, so, one time, I decided if I'm gonna get hit, if I do or don't hit back, fuck it, I'm gonna hit back, so I started being like a fighter, like, fighter i don't know how to make the sound but i started so i was like you know what either way i'm gonna get fucked up so i started fucking people up and um people would be scared of me then it will it would work kind of it will stop the bullying and stuff but that's not the right way to go and when i was in sixth grade the worst thing the bad thing i did with it took it because i started being so depressed and shit nobody noticed that was really good at the time but then I wasn't good in another way. So what I would do is cut myself. My arm out cut. And I would just be, hide it. Because I would wear like long sleeves, sweaters, whatever. So when I healed, I would just wear it like that, you know. So that was one bad way you do or go with it. Another bad way is going into drugs. Do not do drugs. Do not cut yourself. Do not hurt yourself. Do not do anything that has to do with hurting yourself or anybody else. Please hear me out. There is a way out of this bullshit. All right? I got you. So, I would start smoking weed also when I was in middle school. It will help me with depression, but that's not good because I'm going to need a drug so I can feel better. That's not good. Do not do drugs either. So, I was like, you know what, I can't, one time I was like, I can't take it no more, <sighs> because the things people tell me, I was like, am I really annoying, am I really bothering people, should I really exist in this world, then why am I here, and then I would just be like, feeling like I should die, I should kill myself, I should do all this, I remember one time I felt so bad, I just felt like, because in my middle school there's two, two floors, so the second floor I felt like jumping off, but I didn't. Thank God, I would have been stupid. I was stupid. And the positive way, let me tell you the positive way to go with it. Okay, so one time I was crying so bad, teacher was like, why are you crying? I'm like, oh, I'm not crying, blah, blah. So the staff took me to the main office, and he was like, he called my parents, blah, blah. And then they, I told them about this girl that was always punking on me, always choking me and stuff. So then they did something about it. I told them I did not want people to know that it was me that said it, or I didn't want, so... I, you, I did the right thing. You have, go to your parents, go to an adult, to whoever you know that is there for you or is going to help you when you most need it. Go to them. Do not waste the opportunity to go to them. Wait, that sounds like taking advantage. No, but don't take advantage. Just get help when you need it. Whatever. <laughs> but get help. If you know this person, you're like, oh, I know this person will help me when I most need it, then go to them. And go to your parents, especially your family, whatever the fuck you need, go to them. Do not do any bullshit. Alright? So, 
I did the right thing because then it stopped and then it was kind of working. But then again, it started returning. But then I was like, you know what, bitch, I'm gonna fuck you up. All right, if you keep on doing this bullshit, and she kind of stopped. She just stopped doing the shit. And anyways, thank you for hearing me out. I tried to do it really short because I was doing the other videos and when I was seeing, I was like, oh, it's too fucking long. Um, so be who you want to be. Act how you want to act. Dress how you want to dress. Be who you are. Go this way or that way. You can go many ways to find that perfect path. You have to try new things to know who you really are. It's, of course, you're not going to know who you are until you explore many things and you're like, you know what, I feel like this is me. I feel like this is right. Don't be afraid to go different paths. But do not go down a bad path, all right? Stay in the fucking positive side. Don't be bullshitting me, all right? Be there for you. So, be who you want to be. Try different things. Try new things. Everyone tries different things and you finally find who you really are. Like, if you can answer the question who you are, it's okay. Keep exploring. Thank you so much for watching. I was probably pretty long, but if you got to this point, thank you so much for taking your time, sitting down, clicking on this video and watching it. Thank you so much. I don't know if I gave you some advice or helped you out, but... Stay healthy, stay positive, the sun will shine. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment below what you would like. See you next. Share it to your friends. And subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have new videos every week. And I will see you next time. Peace.